So we've got new courses coming out um, for the Brighton SEO conference on 27th of this month, April. Um, what's, the, what's the difference between the courses that we are launching and the other courses that are out there just now? For me, the courses we're launching are giving people actionable tips and advice. Over the years I've seen many courses providing uh, how good the, kind of, the people that write the courses are um, and they don't actually offer you how to do it, you know, they don't show you the tools, they don't demonstrate anything. Um, so I think our, ours will all be stuff that people can then go away in action um, after they do the course so they'll be able to go and implement these things on their website. Um, that's the main difference. Um, we do use graphics, screencasts um, and text just to get the points across. I think a lot of courses out there are very text heavy and also ours are full of screencasts and actual demonstrations and videos which will hopefully help people learn. Um, I think you know having that visual um, element to learning is quite important. These are courses that someone could essentially buy, do and then implement in their business to actually make a, a difference to their, their digital market online. Yep, so people can log in, uh, they'll, they'll get a login as soon as they buy the course, um, they can go through all the modules at their own pace and they then go away and implement the um, parts that they learn into their own business. Um, it is written like a step-by-step -step guide anyway, so you can do like module one, two and three, for example, which might be setting up your analytics, search console um, and your Google map listings and then, you know, carry on. You can do that, learn it, um, implement it and then go on and carry on and do another few modules, go away, learn it uh, or implement it and then go back. Um, and carry on with the course. So you can do it at your own pace or you can read through the whole lot and then um, go and implement it, whatever whatever suits the people themselves. So there's there's five courses that we're launching. Um, if we can just go through them just in a wee bit more detail just so we can let everybody know um, sort of what's involved um, in each of them. So the first one, we're launching a beginner's SEO course and an advanced SEO yep. course. Um, who would you say that the, uh, the beginner's SEO course would be uh, targeted towards? Um, probably pe the beginner's one will probably be better for people who want to have a better understanding of SEO or even you know a, a, an SEO exec in an office that doesn't really know the basics. Um, the basic course will be there. It doesn't go into advanced strategies or whatever but it's there um, at a low cost op option that will show you all the tools that you need to know and all the basic stuff that you need to implement both on and off site. This could also be beneficial for a web, a business owner who maybe just wants to have a better understanding of what their SEO company is doing um, or as I say someone, an SEO exec who wants to learn the core basics um, to then find out if SEO is really for them. and. Uh, you know, if, if not, then, you know, they've not lost that much money, it's very affordable, so, you know, a lot of people look at SEO, don't really understand it, and I'm not sure if it's a good career choice, so it's a, certainly a great entry level um, course for anyone who is thinking about making that choice. The advanced course is, it goes into everything in a lot more detail, I would emphasise that people don't need to do the basic then advanced, you would either buy the basic or the advanced, the, the advanced course has all the basics in it, but everything else is just in a lot more detail. The advanced one is more for people who do SEO for a living, but are maybe weak in specific areas, and I'm going to show everyone everything that I've learned over the years that worked for me, so, um, you know, giving it all away in the advanced course. A lot of small businesses, we know ourselves that a lot of small businesses come to us and they've set up an AdWords account and it's an absolute disaster. Yeah. Um, I take it this course would be designed again as a sort of walkthrough just to show you how to do a proper setup. Yep. I mean, <laughs> you know, we, we do get a lot of businesses that come to us um, needing help with AdWords and AdWords is fairly simple and straightforward. There's not too much um, 
There's nothing too technical there, it's just about doing the right research and implementing all the right bidding strategy, selecting the right keywords, negative keywords, filling out your site link extensions and, and using the platform to its you know full ability. A lot of people just switch on AdWords Express, which is just a case of you know Google burning your money based on what they feel is the most important keywords, which isn't always correct. So it is, it's a step-by-step -step guide showing you how to build a campaign and uh, using the right tools to do your keyword research. Um, and it basically goes through every single last option you've got on AdWords um, to be able to you know, build your own campaign and, and you know, tweak it and refine it until you get you know, a massive return on your investment. We use a lot of social media automation tools in here. I take it that's what we're going to be sort of pushing in the, yeah. the social media course, is that right? Yeah, I mean social media is easy, you know, anyone can pick it up. I think even, you know, kids today are very active on social media, but businesses don't know how to grow their own followings, they don't know all the other stuff that goes on behind it, even how to do paid um, advertising, setting up a Facebook pixel, how all that works. Um, it's all very simple and straightforward, but you know that there are other elements of automation, whether it's LinkedIn automation, Twitter automation, Facebook automation, there's certainly a hell of a lot of stuff that goes on in the background for me, which would benefit businesses to, to fully understand what's out there, what tools are available. There's a million tools out there, that people portray are the best tools out there, but they're not. You know, I've spent tens of thousands of pounds over the years um, tracking, testing different tools, and some of them are absolute garbage. So this will show you the best tools that are working at present, and you'll not have to, you know, run about trying and testing 20 different things, costing you an absolute fortune. And again, it's a very low cost option to get those tips. I think you know, um, some of the automation tools are invaluable to. Um, businesses so it's certainly worth um, doing that course and then finally we've got the agency SEO course um, and again we do training for agencies all the time I take it this is designed to just pull all of that training that we do for, for agencies together um, so that they can learn it online yeah I mean obviously what agencies do compared to what an, an advanced SEO course for example would do what you, you know you've got a lot more on the reporting side the justification side and um, having built up my own agency in the past I think there's a lot of tips and advice that I can share which will help you you know refine your processes and stuff like that with an agency as I say most SEOs um, do what they do and you know as, as an agency that what you would tell a client would be something completely different certainly things you can't tell a client um, if you're in an agency that you're doing this or that so the agency side um, will help anyone who's looking to start up their own agency certainly how to it will go into how to scale up even how to delegate how to outsource um, how to report, all the tools you use for reporting and basically all the other mistakes and all the other crap that um, I had as an agency owner um, which I absolutely hated by the way <laughs> um, uh, which is why we try and steer clear of client work but yeah there's certainly a lot of experience I picked up along the way and as I say we as you say we train a lot of agencies and it's frightening some of the knowledge that these agencies have got uh, it's, it's really quite poor or very basic so hopefully the agency course will help anyone in an agency at an advanced level to pick up on everything including reporting and justification how to manage clients expectations and everything else that goes on